Now these cups are the, just five races. It's basically uh, the exact same races from story mode. Now I'm gonna use Tails because he's my favorite character. Now you have Ru um, Cream Rouge and um, Shadow, and also you have um, Doctor Eggman here. Now these I've never some of these are robots, some of these are just other characters. I've actually never actually 100 percent unlocked these characters. Some of them are like really weird, like to speed. Anyways, you have the Yellow Tail, which is Sonic's, um, not Sonic. This Tail's main one. Um, Darkness, which is Shadows. The Eat Rider, which is, um, Dr. Eggman's. Now, you might think, because this one is really good, you should do this. However, um, you would think so, but I never ever, like, the stats can be misleading in this game. I just never like the feel of the, it doesn't, it feels like you're actually riding a bike. So you can't really corner as well, and even though it says you can corner well, it doesn't really work that way. Anyways, um, dash is to your top, no, dash is your boost, limit is your top speed, power is your hitting ability, and cornering is just turn. Now, Tails is the flying character, we obviously knew that already. Now this is basically like a normal cup, you know, like a Mario Kart style here, where you'll be ranked on how you place, and you get how many points for how many where you place. It doesn't matter uh, how many um, that's what I'm looking for um, tricks, what your time is. It just matters how well you finish. It doesn't matter how you get there. It just matters. What, up, get me off! That dang it! I'm gonna take the short my um, the flying shortcut there. And we'll have the announcer entering like random words like watch him fly that turbulence. Look at him ride that turbulence. Yeah, you can I never got that. Now Tails attack is a plug, which is you know think about it, it's very deadly. Ooh! See, I always love how you just decide to wave when you have to we almost kill someone. See you later! I almost killed you! Bye! Don't know how I got rings, because I probably picked up one of those. And can I actually take my shortcut? Nope, nope, still can't take my shortcut. Now when it's level 2, he actually has a more circular attack. And now I'm level 3, nice. Oh, pff, that was short. And then he gets to plug again back at a wolf. Can never get up there. Get up there, thank you. And then he takes advantage of the speed. There we go. Thank you. Great job. Now, here's the flying part. Now, actually, if I, I don't think I explained it, but flying is actually um, airplane style. If you don't know what airplane style is, it's basically saying up is down and down is up when you move it. Now, I've, I guess it's more authentic because you're flying through the air, but I never liked that because it just feels weird in my opinion. You don't hear about, care about my opinion, just can't play. Now, unless someone gets the high road, we should have this, yeah, I got it. Now the grading scale for this is like Mario Kart style, where they have 10, I think it's 10, 8, 6, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Now that is sadly exactly copied from Mario Kart Double Dash. That is the exact same grading scale. It's that creepy, but it does make sense, but I mean, you could, you, this game did copy, this is a kind of a tad from Mario Kart clone in some ways, I mean. Then again, any kart racer, any franchise decided to slap their main star onto a racing game. It was magically called a clone of Mario Kart, even if there wasn't much. I mean, I could just call it. Now, there's actually a. You can actually go up that way with flying, but I've never really tried to get there. Now, up here, you can go up here, and that's a shortcut. They always have like either one or two um, jumps where if you go high, it's like, a shortcut. So if you can figure out which one of those are actually shortcuts, take advantage of that. 
Now I got the rings. And as soon as you get out of the last one, I do recommend like pushing down. Try to land as fast as you can. You may think it's a tad strange, but however, when you're flying in the air, you are not as fast as when you're on the ground. I don't know how in the world that went so far. Let's get in there, thank you. Losing the Amy? Yeah, I'm losing the Amy. There we go! So that one's actually not much of a shortcut, but it is a shortcut nonetheless. It won't help you improve your time by, like, uh, a huge margin, but it, it is increasing nonetheless. I mean, this actually, to be told, there is actually not a lot of shortcuts that actually will help improve your time. Even the shortcuts itself with the like the different routes you can take with class you are, that itself actually isn't that much of an advantage. Cause I mean I just shaved it like a couple of seconds off the time. That was a bad jump. There we go. Finally got it. ranked up second. I also wonder what, why, besides rings, rings can also, I don't think I've shown this off, but then actually you can go to the shop and buy like new kind of stuff with them. Like stuff I mean gear. I'm trying to get up there. Get up there third. Not bad, but yeah. Bit better, especially with how well the first race went. Thank goodness Rouge didn't do well, so I'm pretty sure my lead is safe. <laughs> Last. Yeah, 16, 16, 10, 8, 7. My main competitor here is Knuckles. Knuck that knucklehead. Now um, we have Knuckles Racer now ahead. With the Egg Factory. Now, um, you can, like, purpose, you can always do the strategy of, like, like, trying to pick on it, on that, uh, opponent player, and just try to do it that way, but I always felt like just showing no favoritism always worked better. Now you can also go up there for a, um, a shortcut, and let's see if we can do that later. Now, so you can go this way. No, you can't retry. That's also a problem with this. You cannot retry. After you do it, you're stuck. And I, right now, I need to make up some big ground. I actually did get over here, though. This is actually a shortcut. So you can definitely, uh, prove your time to go this way. I didn't want some rings though. Cause... I'm just getting air. So I really don't want that. Get up there, nope. I did land right into someone else's drift, which was nice. I'll take it, Sonic. Wait, can, I, can we catch up? No. Let's try this like, the right way. There we go. And it will be slowed down if you run into the lava. So don't try that. Ooh, get over here again. Oh, Knuckles in first. Hey, he is going to be my main competitor here. I mean, he is winning by a lot. He's not really, like, close. He is running away with this thing. Oh, oh, wow. <laughs> Thank goodness I was there. And I just somehow passed him. Nope. No, I didn't pass him. For some reason, just said, give me a lie that said, hey, look, you passed him. I just knocked out on Rouge there. 
Uh, we got quickly go back down here. Try this again. Do not fail. Thank you. I'm actually gonna take a short fight. I'm high pursuit. See if we can catch me here. Nope, got me. He's up by two points now. But it did manage to cut off a lot of time the second lap there. I ended up losing by like half a second. It's basically me and Knuckles who are battling for this lead. Next is the forest. What's it called? What's it called? What's it called? Green K, there you go. Now there's two main strategies you can have. Like you can knock out that goes right away. Uh for the starting you can actually back up and then try to land. Or you can do just quickly run up to it and as soon as it disappears, just quickly um, go through. That's you can choose whatever strategy you like better. I always like the back and up strategy. It's always a strategy I've always preferred. Hey, wave. I wave. <laughs> Catch my drift. I never realized if X on um, the shaking ever improved your speed or actually improved the rate of the air you got. When I think about it, it actually might be the later. With actually just spinning it, it increases the amount of air you'll take in. Wave is just right on my tail. Zzz. Just do one little spin there. There you go, level two. Oops. Lantern. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. When in, I just ended up finding a uh, shortcut. Okay, as you can, see, I finally figured that out. The gold canister there of rings that I was trying to find in the, which I was passed by multiple times in the dark desert one, is actually a hundred rings, which is very nice. I'm actually way far in the lead. I don't need rings! Well, that's the first time I've said that in a long time. <laughs> I actually needed air that time instead of rings. It's been a while since I said that. I don't know, I actually don't. Hey, you got the sexing speed, so I don't think there's any. It's only air intake is what only matters. Stop giving me rings! <laughs> don't need them. There we go, and that should be it. And wow, I won this race by a lot. I like this course, I'm good at it, and I like it. Getting the 100 rings, bonus finding that there. Look at that. Look at that win. That's a beaut. I need a, either... I have to get at least third to win the cup. Third or better. Never better. Third or better, never better. With the last race of the... Uh, oh, yes, and wins. Now, it's weird. Uh, I don't think Babylon is actually in this. I don't know why they didn't decide to put Babylon as the last track, but they just didn't. They said, hey, look, let's, we only have room for five. And also, it does make sense, because this is technically, they have the Grand Prix. And technically, this would make it the Grand Prix. I mean, the five races was in it. But instead, they didn't have the elimination kind of system, which they had actually in the start mode. So actually now I can just do this. Actually, wow, I've, I'm getting a lot of rings. Take that. See ya! I like tails. <laughs> so 
funny how he just goes, Bye! I always liked Tails. He was always my favorite character. Don't know why or how, but he just always is. Now I'm gonna see if I can try to get over here off this. Oh, I got it. And I can jump up over here and land up here and get the gold ring. There's, uh, I think now, if I recall my memory correctly, there is one gold ring in hidden in every race. So if you can find them, I've actually found three so far. I'm getting, what, what's with me getting all the rings suddenly? And I would just... Look, like I'm rolling in dough. I need air. I need more air again. Some of them are a little more hidden than the other one. This one's actually pretty dang obvious. It's like, and also it only appears once, so that's interesting. So after someone collects it, no one can collect it again. And it's basically, I've got this one in the bag. I've got this more in the bag than, wow. I am winning by a lot. I mean a lot, I mean... Holy cow, and call. I don't know. World record books. I mean, that was. I mean, these back to back races have not been close. So that's what also kind of happens if you can find the golden ring. I mean, you just. Won it. And that's. You won and received 400 rings. So that's a little money bonus. Money, money, money.